My name is Alpha and I'm the project leader for the race Darwin. The idea of the race came out of the Hewa Regional Youth Summit, where a group of young people decided that racism is still a major issue in their communities that needs to be tackled. With the race, we decided to show that yes, we can be different. And yes, maybe there are times when we don't understand each other. But as a community, we can all come together and try to understand and open our minds and have fun, celebrate our differences. And this is why we made this short film, to show you how young people from Darwin decided to overcome their fears and open their minds to new experiences. We hope you enjoy it, almost as much as we did planning it. The racial and cultural experience now here at the capital of the Northern Territory, Darwin City. It's a place renowned for its relaxed atmosphere and population comprising of people of many different cultural backgrounds. Today, 11 teams of three will have an opportunity to race through different stations around Darwin City and get a taste of five countries' cultural experience. This race will allow them to learn teamwork, use their wits, and discover each country's tradition and get an authentic experience. Of Australia, by the Arab sea, there's my lovely home called Darwin in the Northern Territory. She's a jewel of a city and I hope she'll always be free from life's unwelcome turmoil that can come relentlessly. She's a multiracial beauty. She's an adolescent girl. She's a jewel of Australia. She's the Arab Europe. Oh, she's the Arab Europe. My Arab Europe. I think you're being absolutely awesome. This is a fantastic and exciting event for the city. You've made their commitment to come out and to actually enjoy a very, very unique event. It, the first of its kind in Darwin. I have to congratulate the organisers. What I'd like to say though is standing here looking at you all and saying, seeing you all here, all young people from so many different walks of life and so many different cultures and you're going to be experiencing so many other cultures. I want to just say thank you. Thank you for contributing to the rich tapestry of what we call our Darwin life. Thank you for having a go. I know you're going to have awesome fun doing it, so thanks very much. Now racers, it's the time of reckoning. Remember there's $1,500 on the line here. The aim of the game is easy. To win the race, you need to visit five countries, complete all the challenges, and get to the finish line first. Can I call all the team captains? All the team captains to stand at the starting line. Over there. Your team, as soon as you get one, and open the envelope attached to the flag. This will tell you where you need to go next. Changwa Society is the organisation representing uh, primarily the local Chinese uh, in Darwin and the Northern Territory. The challenges are to go through the museum and uh, answer the questions that we've asked of them. Uh, hopefully in, in doing that they'll learn uh, a fair bit about um, the presence and the, uh, the contribution that the Chinese have played to the history of the territory. There's a second question. Dennis Chen was also evacuated on Zealandia. What was the famous thing that you remember seeing? What's that? 
Uh, Bernice Chen. Weakness says, um, Your height, you could, he could hit things. He's really tall. I'm also a hillbilly. What about lack of height? Oh, lack no, of height. No, that, that's an advantage. Can, yeah. I can go under legs of people. Do I think we're gonna win? Ooh. We're gonna hope, so. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna yeah. hope. I don't know. Yeah. I'm just gonna say yes. Yeah, well. <laughs> be positive and then it'll happen. Stop needing cuddles. Yeah, I need to say into William. We're looking for Jeffrey. Jeffrey and Bernice. Clearly, Jeffrey, Jeffrey, Jeffrey. Then you go to Chinese Museum. Somewhere to the most. Yeah, no weaknesses at all, you know, all strength here. Yeah. Now, I think, I'm guessing because it's obviously racial and cultural experience, my, I don't have that much experience with other cultures, so that might be a bit of a factor if there's activities on that kind of thing. All the way to the back end. Back end. Oh, we are gonna yeah. win. Yeah. Mm -mm. We think no we're the best team out there. We yeah. are. The, we don't think we, we are. are. Yeah. We, are, we the are the best team out there. It's true. Someone told me this before that we're the best team. So yeah, yeah believe it. That confirms we are the best. Yeah. <laughs> Lord Mayor Katrina Fomblin is the great granddaughter of Fong Ding and the granddaughter of George Fulton. Okay, so we need to go walk it out. Hang on, what is the full name of her mother and father? Family business. Looking for. Must be family treatment. Alright, I'll have a look at this. You guys, just have a look around. But it's Fong Ding. George Fook Lim Fong is the granddaughter, so... Did you know me? Right, this one's Hey, we can try that. So we're here. Five minutes, four hundred meters, we got this. Oh, damn it! <laughs> My strategy is basically to um, run as fast as we can. <laughs> And these teams complete all the challenges waiting for them in Darwin City. Who will finish last and can they all reach the finish line in time? And most importantly, who are going to be the race Darwin winners and take home the prize money? Um, she was feeling unwell, so like um, she couldn't survive that long. Nico, this is Harry, come on! I know, come on! Come on. <laughs> this is oh, Shabba! You don't know that you're Shabba! I'm from North India!